Happy Thursday, everybody. Meteorologist Hunter Forrest here. We still have about a month and a half left of the 2024 Atlantic hurricane season. We've already seen 13 name storms. The last one was Milton, which made landfall in Florida just last week as a category three. The first one to make landfall in the Tampa Bay area as a major hurricane in over a hundred years. Now the next name on the list would be Nadine after that Oscar over towards Patty. Hopefully we don't have to see any more names popping up. But as we take a look at the tropical Atlantic, two areas we're monitoring right now. We have Invest 94L, which is just towards the east of the Caribbean right now, making its way off towards the west, towards the north of Puerto Rico. It has the chance to start to develop. But the good news is those chances have continued to go down over the last couple of days. The other day it had about a 60% chance of development. Now it's down to 30. So that is some good news there. And if it was to develop into anything, it's more likely it would say to the south of the United States, a few cold fronts dropping through, which would help it keep it down towards the south. So not much to worry about there. Some excellent news. We also have this area in the Southern Caribbean, only a 20% chance of development within the next week. But if this was really to develop, it's looking like it would just be a rainmaker for portions of Central America over towards Mexico. So the good news is there's really not much to worry about right now for the United States in terms of any landfalling tropical systems. But again, the hurricane season doesn't end until the end of November, November 30th. So we still have to continue monitoring the tropics. And of course, we'll continue to keep you updated here on 13 News Now if we do continue to see any more developments in the tropics.